Here's your forecast first from Fox 11 meteorologist Phil DeCastro. Pretty quiet right now, still fairly mild. Temperature sitting at 25 degrees, 18 by the time we reach the morning, but getting back up into the 30s tomorrow and plenty of sunshine in these icons as well. Going to be another sunny day and with those mostly sunny skies, you might imagine the severe weather index is low over the next 24 hours. Your weather story staying mild for the days on Sunday and Monday and it'll actually be mild as we move on into the middle portions of next week as well, but be coming with some unsettled weather. So that's why I decided to split these two days off from the middle of next week. Here's what your temperatures will be looking like, your highs and your lows. Getting up to close to 40 degrees by Tuesday. Your low temperature is not even that chilly either. The average high this time of the year is around 29. Our low is going to be near there on uh, Tuesday night on into Wednesday. And uh, again, just kind of being uh, mild and quiet for the next couple of days. Right now through the rest of northeastern Wisconsin, 21 Clintonville, a little bit chillier in Anago, 14 degrees there, 21 Marinette, 25 in Sturgeon Bay, as well as in Green Bay right now, 28 in Appleton as you move out further off to the south and west, 23 Wapaka, 20 in Watoma. But no matter where you go, really just very clear skies. Appleton reporting a couple clouds, but I'm sure they're very few and far in between at this point. Uh, your highs today will only come down about 10 degrees from those. And with clear skies and calm winds, we've usually dipped further than that. 35 was your high temperature in Green Bay, and you can see those mid 30s on throughout most of the area, near 30 through parts of the North Woods. We're still very clear out there, and that's going to help our temperatures to fall just a little bit more before we reach morning. Uh, but the active weather that we saw overnight tonight, well, that's moved well on away from us. Snow showers now pushing on through New England and actually falling apart. Uh, and rain showers off to our south will be staying there. So severe weather in the deep south, but again, staying quiet for us. With high pressure actually parked just about overhead. So the clear skies will be sticking with us as we move on through the day tomorrow. Here's what your temperatures are right now through the region. Fairly mild no matter where you go, except for Rhinelander, a little bit chillier there. But other than that, pretty temperate and air is going to be staying in place. The wind's not too strong. High pressure part just about overhead, allowing our winds to calm down a little bit. So here's what your temperatures will do as we move on through the day. Tomorrow we're going to be getting up into the mid 30s, not cooling off too much Sunday night then back up into the upper 30s by the time we reach the day on Monday. And as for your sky cover, not a whole lot of clouds, some off to our north. I think generally other than that, we're going to be staying nice and sunny through Sunday. Tonight, 18 degrees, clear and quiet, light winds to calm at times. For tomorrow, southwest and light, 36 degrees, mostly sunny. And then for Monday, 38 degrees, increasing clouds. That comes ahead of that snow that I was talking about on Tuesday. And I'm not quite sure how much we're going to get, especially because how warm it's going to be at the surface, but certainly a situation that's worth monitoring and not really cooling off until we hit next weekend, it looks like. That's right, yeah, next weekend, Friday, Saturday, finally getting below freezing once again. I know, that's really pretty remarkable. So far for the month, we're actually almost 10 degrees above average, so it's been a very mild month. Not a lot of complaining, but... No, uh, right. Got Except for those it. who like to ski or snowshoe. That's, that's or very true. That's very sledding. true. But after the past couple of winters being so snowy, it's nice to have a winter off. It perhaps. is nice to have a little break. <laughs>